Hey, good day, it's Dan here, coming at you with another video. So it is uh, Tuesday afternoon, I'm just here waiting to pick up the kids again from school. And uh, just before I left the house to come over here, I was on a uh, impromptu millionaire mentoring session uh, with my mentor and a number of the other um, members of our team. And we were talking about uh, the hurdles, the the challenges that we all face, and and what holds us back from reaching our full potential and having major breakthroughs. So, uh, one of the challenges that I've been wrestling with is is just getting out of my own way. Uh, I'm in the process of taking my business to a whole new level, and yet I, I I'm coming up against resistance, and and maybe you can relate to that. Uh, Maybe things are, you know you want to step things up a little bit and, and take them to a new level, uh, have new levels of accomplishment, that sort of thing. And for whatever reason, things just aren't clicking or you're, you're getting in your own way. You're not taking the actions you know you should. And uh, what came up out of that conversation was that in a lot of instances, I downplay the value of what I know, what I share, uh, the expertise that I have. And and in my mind, the inner chatter is that, uh, you know, this isn't valuable to people, so why share it? And that's the wrong thinking. That's stinking thinking. Because I know that what I share has value from the feedback that I receive from people when I share it. You know, I, I regularly get feedback from people saying, that was awesome. Thanks so much for sharing that. I'm I'm really looking forward to applying that in my life. And so my mentor, uh, after we had a bit of a discussion around this, his suggestion was, okay, let's have a look at where your focus is. And through the conversation, obviously, the focus was on uh, the stinking thinking, on the negative, on the, the doubting thoughts. So his exercise for me, which I'm going to do as soon as I get back to the office, is to take out a notepad. I'm going to pull out my gratitude journal and to make a list of all the accomplishments or accolades or times I've received recognition for something. All the times I've done something really well that, that somebody acknowledged or noticed. And to put some focus on that because obviously we all have value to offer people. We all have knowledge that somebody else would benefit from knowing. And so don't discount what you know and focus on on where your accomplishments have been. Don't uh, don't get sucked down that rabbit hole of, of stinking thinking uh, because it'll draw you right in and you'll get stuck down there. So focus on your accomplishments. Do this little exercise. Pull out a notepad, pull out a piece of paper and make a list that I don't know how long it's going to be. It could be you spend five minutes. It could be you spend half an hour or an hour journaling on all the things you've done well in your life. And don't downplay it. Celebrate your successes. So that's the encouragement I've got for you. That's the homework I have for myself. And I'm going to do that as soon as I pick up the kids and get back home. So watch for the, watch for an update on that. I'll probably uh, list some of it on my blog or something to that effect. You'll probably find this video there. And, uh, and I hope you celebrate your successes as well. And I look forward to what you create as a result. So hope you're doing well. Make it a great day. If you're looking to, you know, make some changes in your life, if, if you realize that working for the man and uh, that your job just isn't fulfilling you the way you want it to and you want to start pursuing your passions more, then check out my website at leave9to5behind.com. Go take a look because we're helping people platform their passions online uh, all around the world and we're setting people free. So join the Freedom Team. Come do what we do. Live the lifestyle you deserve and uh, help others do the same. So that's all I got for you today. All the best to you. I hope you're doing well and we'll talk to you again soon. Bye for now.